hey angels welcome back to unique mystery so today we're going to talk about the absolute worst thing and the best thing that happened to me in 2017 so 2016 and 2017 have been the worst years of my life angels the absolute worst years of my life okay starting in the end of 2016 was when I lost my mama so 2016 was hell for me absolutely hell so that was the end of 2016 so I went into 2017 having to deal with losing my mama in the end of 2016 so another year of absolutely hell okay I had to deal with losing my best friend you know I was so so very close to my mom I was very very close to her okay um some people don't get to experience you know being close to their mother some people don't even know their mothers some people may not even like their mothers because they have never been there for them and that's all of that is understandable but I had the opportunity to have my mother in my life okay my mother was in my life all of my life and she helped me with dealing with a lot of stuff and she was always there for me okay so I had to end up dealing with losing her the end of 2016 I do not know how I dealt with it I don't know how I got through it the only thing I know is I kept faith in God and I prayed okay after that or other than that I don't know how I got through it okay I'm still not absolutely through with it because I'm still dealing with it today and I deal with it every day okay it's something you will never ever get over okay so I deal with it on a daily basis but in 2017 it was fresh and I did not know how how I survived okay I know God was by my side I do know that but it was very difficult it was very hard it still is hard because as soon as I think of her or a moment I remember I start crying in 2017 I could not even go grocery shopping without crying like I went grocery shopping in 2017 and like I went um, any type of shopping I did like when I go to the stores for some reason every time I go in the store I get to the um, cashier I start to think of my mama because she, a lot of times she would be with me like when I'm going to the store shopping so I would start crying while I'm in the stores while I'm buying my food while I'm buying clothes I would just be in the stores crying okay so you know it ended up with a lot of people you know in the store asking me if I was okay and stuff like that so yeah it was just very very tough 
to deal with in 2017. And like I say, it's still very tough, but I've kind of got past the point of crying everywhere I go. I still do cry when I go places, but I'm able to hide it more better now. Um, in 2017, I just couldn't hide it. Like It would just start coming out, but I'm better with hiding the fact that I'm crying now from people. So that was the worst thing, you know, that happened to me in 2017. Like I said, my mom passed the end of 2016, but 2017 was when I had to deal with everything. So that was the worst time for me in 2017. In 2016, I got engaged. So in 2017, I got married, okay? So that was the best thing that happened to me in 2017 was me getting married. When I got engaged in 2016, it was around the time when, around the same time when um, my mother got sick. First I got engaged, then in the same month after me being happy about that, in the same month, okay, she got sick. Then the next month, she passed, okay? So, that's why 2016 and 17 was the worst years of my life because, once again, during 2017 was when I had to deal with everything. Um, so, those were very hard times and the worst, most difficult times of my life, okay? Still dealing with it now. And I'm hoping that 2018 brings more, more better things for me. I feel like I deserve it, so I really hope that 2018 will bring brighter things, but this is something I will never ever get over. I know that, okay? I will never ever get over the fact that I I have lost my mom. So that was the worst thing that I had to deal with and face in um, 2017. And like I said, the best thing was me getting married in 2017. So 2017 was like a crazy year. A crazy year. And um, if I could, I could, if I could, I would bring my mom back. That would be my New Year's wish to bring her back. But I know that can't happen, so I have to keep going. I have to keep going. And I made it to 2018, <clears throat> which sometimes I do not know how I made it, but God kept me alive, so he's not done with me yet, and he has more things for me to do, so I'm, I have to keep going. So those were the worst and the best thing that happened to me in 2017. And I'm hoping and praying for a positive and a good, happy 2018 for me and for you guys as well. So, um, let me know in the comment section what 
was the best and the worst part of your 2017 so happy new years and 2018 I'm wishing for a much better time for all of us so I will see you angels in my next video don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and comment thanks angels and I'll see you guys in my next video bye